Whoop whoop, let's continue the Medal of Honor. I'm always the glad to play this. Tomorrow, and you won't let us land with our unit? Your old unit, Sergeant. You three are no longer combat engineers. You are now invaluable OSS assets. Your orders for the invasion are to brief and advise, not participate. Is that why we have this overgrown babysitter? The MP is a request from General Donovan himself. He knows about your special relationship with orders you don't agree with. Permission to speak freely, sir? No. <laughs> I'll think he was going to say this is complete bullshit. <laughs> Horse shit, actually, but close enough, Holly. Gentlemen. That beach tomorrow will be a meat grinder, and you know it. Our unit is short-handed without us. They're going to get killed. That's enough, Sergeant. You're dismissed. Oh. Wait, follow him. <laughs> the sergeant is the bravest soldier I've ever known. You know he still carries German shrapnel from the Western Front in his back? Causes him pain every waking moment. But you'll never hear him complain. He does his best to hide it. But there's one thing, one simple truth, he can't hide from. Sir? Ali, there's one certain, absolute, unbreakable truth in this universe. And the sergeant knows it better than anyone. You ever wonder why someone with his experience doesn't carry a much higher rank? 1936, the Spanish Civil War. The Nazis get involved in a big way, using it as a test run for their new planes and tanks. The United States stays neutral, of course, but the sergeant's son, his only son, is one of these idealistic young men that runs off and volunteers to fight. With little or no training, these boys are going up against a fascist juggernaut. When he hears the news about his son volunteering, the sergeant asks permission to go after him. It's denied, so Sarge goes AWOL, hops on a tramp steamer to Spain, lands on the coast, and races to the front line. When he finally gets there, he learns his son was killed the day before, in a Stuka attack. I had no idea. I'm the one who got him out of the stockade after his court-martial. As you might imagine, the sergeant was a very tough father. Never told his son that he loved him. And now, he lives every day with the fact that he never will. So as I said, the sergeant knows the truth better than anyone. It's a truth that transcends ideology and borders. And that truth is... War kills young men. Lovely. To go see Huxley. Dismissed. <laughs> Thanks for this <laughs> upper morals. Huxley, new weapons! Oh, a new RPG! Oh, <laughs> bazooka! Oh, that's pretty nice. Quiet! I still have yet to hit someone with a knife. <laughs> oh wait, did you see that? It was homing for a while. So maybe it's actually gonna be like easier to throw. Oh yeah, it's homing now. Nice. Sarge, give me this. It's not for kids. Don't you dare. Ah, oh, it's gonna be a mission. The beach assault. Let's go there. I always thought the number of takeoffs was supposed to match the number of landings, but I guess you boys in the 82nd are the exception to that rule. I know this is the first time some of you will see combat. I know you're scared. Well, let me be clear with all of you, I'm scared too. Never forget, the Nazis are smart. They didn't take over half the civilized world by accident. They are the best trained and best equipped fighting force the world has ever seen, and they are the most evil. That's why we're here. We're here to free those they've enslaved. And to avenge those they've killed. I look forward to seeing you all in France. Yes, sir. That was very moving, Sergeant. Who the fuck are you? We need to get you back to headquarters. I have orders to return you to Whitehall before 1900 hours. Roger that, Private, of course. But before we go, the Colonel asked me to 
pick up a bottle of sherry from the airbase commander. Mm-mm. No, Sergeant. No can do. What's the problem? It's right over there in the tower. I have extremely specific orders. I am to escort you to the flight line, return you to the jeep, and back to London. Because of your... special history, we are not to deviate from that plan. <clears throat> it's just a bottle of sherry. You want to be the one to disappoint the Colonel when we come back without it? <laughs> I know I don't. Listen to him. Lieutenant, come on, war hero. Okay. Lieutenant, we'll meet you back at the Jeep. Thank you. Can I drive back to London? Uh, you know, it's before, Sergeant. Absolutely yeah. not. Just part way. No. Whoa. <laughs> That's so cool, especially with those graphics, like you can see clearly the history. Safari. The Colonel sure loves his sherry. What is a sherry, <laughs> actually? <laughs> oh, I wonder if this works even. <gasps> no. In Half-Life Alex, it worked. So, Sherry, I wonder what could that be? <laughs> Knowing Sarge, he's gonna have a gun or something called Sherry. Hello? Oh. Um, hi! I'm just passing by. Where is well, the high pressure system is gonna go here if it goes north. <sighs> oh. Sherry. Urgent. Top secret. Shh. Okay, let's go. Ali. Oh. Sergeant? Sergeant, please. Please, Sergeant. Sergeant, please exit the vehicle. <laughs> <laughs> but I really want to drive. I am not going to ask you again, sir. Um. Sergeant. Sergeant. Private, would you like to see a magic trick? What? Look what's behind my ear. Hey. <gasps> Oh my god! <laughs> That's probably not true, right? <laughs> I mean, he did the right thing because he was trained to do that, so. So, where to, Ollie? Weymouth, in Dorset. Weymouth. Oh, it's gonna be close. <laughs> Adventure! How much trouble do you think we're in? Quite a bit, Ollie, quite a bit. We're headed one of two places France. Stockade. What? Lieutenant, Whoa. you need to find the present the quartermaster left for us. It was fast. Find those supplies or we'll be attacking Nazi Germany with just our wits. Okay, Jesus Christ. But move. <laughs> oh, well. Hello there, Lieutenant. Hi. I didn't know you were back. I'm just passing by, don't worry. <laughs> Where do we go? Oh, okay. Hello. Ooh. Hi, Huxley. Good luck, Lieutenant. Life is usually a pageant of idiots and fools. But occasionally, you find yourself in the company of good people. <laughs> and then... Anything is possible. Wise words. Oh yeah, okay. No, not plugging the way. So, what did I pick? I don't have any weapons yet. I'm so defenseless. Oh, I'm coming! <laughs> I'm trying? Jumping! Okay, well. <laughs> hey, sir, we can't believe it. No one knew what happened to you after Tunisia. Oh, we joined the OS. We got a new assignment. But now we're back. <laughs> Man, the clock is running. We're shoving off. Famous assault on the beach. We all know it's going to be a tough job ahead. But it's good for us to be together. That's all we can ask for. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> watch it, watch it. 
Oh! Well, that was unlucky. Please don't explode. <laughs> This is not my weapon, but I have to use it. Oh wow! <laughs> Excuse you? Uh. <laughs> Shit! Explosive? <laughs> ah, okay. I'm destroying the obstacles. Oh, damn it! <laughs> now! <laughs> Shit! Coming! Ow! Hot damn, it's intense. Wait, grab a fuse lighter from the tube. Pull the handle of the fuse lighter to light the fuse. Oh! That was the objective, that's why I was constantly dying. The game didn't want me to progress. <laughs> okay, I mean... <laughs> Here we go. That was kinda literal progress. You're gonna be fine. Oh, hi, soldier. Okay. What now? Oh, there. Okay. <laughs> Don't touch me. Thank you. Okay. Oh no. <laughs> no 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 no. Oh shit. Oh. <gasps> Wait. <laughs> Give me this. <laughs> oh no. Trying. Okay, it's working. Ah, hey, give me this. Dragging a dead body. Get out. Where now? Oh. Why do I even destroy this though? Whoa. <laughs> ah. I think something exploded. Well, <laughs> help me! <laughs> oh, well, you need help then, not me. Oh, I'm fine, okay. Where are my syringes? Oh, at least I have a weapon. <laughs> oh. Bye! Ooh. <laughs> oh, I need this gun. <gasps> Garant! Thank you. <laughs>